All right, my people, welcome back to another EA Sports UFC 2 video. And today, we got a possible, I said a possible hidden gem for you today in a world away, and it's Hung Gyeong Lin. Good, decent stats, not many stats. I like opportunists. I like all the stats that, that take place when you've rocked someone, when you get more speed, more power when they're rocked. I like that stuff. So when you rock people, you don't have to continue rocking people over and over again. When you rock them, you can get them out of here. But... I used Hyun Gon Lin in a fight recently. Obviously, when I'm playing by myself nowadays, I, I, I don't use the best fighters, man. I like to experiment. I never have a favorite who I pick. When I go into a, a weight class, when I random, I always random the weight class. When I get the weight class, I just select on the spot, man. I never have a favorite. I just select. I chose Hyun Gon Lin. Um, he felt really good, but my opponent wasn't great. But he, he did feel really good in terms of striking. So I want to get someone, an opponent who's a little bit better and see how good Hyun Gyeon Lin actually is. I keep saying Lin, it's Lim. BJ Penn is the opponent. And we'll see, this should be a striking battle. BJ Penn is obviously going to have the advantage in the Jiu Jitsu. So we'll see if this guy wants to take it to the ground. If he was smart, he would. Another good thing about Hyun Gyeon Lin is, as you can see right here, he is long. One pause on that 196 centimeter re re reach. He's a tool fighter. I love a tool, not so much reach that matters to me, but tool fighters. It almost feels like you have more reach when they're tall as well. You know that they got longer legs, but yeah, that, that's good. Let's see if this guy is gonna jump straight into it. Yes, he is. Let's do this. Let's do it. You see, he is tall, especially for the welterweight division. I'm not sure how much. Taller Neil Magny is than him. This guy's coming straight out with the leg kicks. Fine by me. Alright. I want to see how long until he stops throwing them. He's still going with them. Five round fight, buddy. It's a five round fight. Uh, okay, I'm going to just avoid this dude. For as long. Yeah, okay. Now he's... <laughs> I want to see how long before he actually throws a punch. See, now he's trying to bait me in. Another leg kick. You're going to throw... There you go, a punch. Alright. Now we could do this. Hung Yon his movement doesn't feel bad at all. I've obviously not got a good opponent, which is what I was looking for, but... Is what it is. You, got, you, you deal with the cards you've been given. One thing that is it seems to be a, a staple of the hidden gems in this game is they usually have like heavy hands game changer something like that or they have the in the move set they have the heavy strikes so they'll have the heavy straight step back bro step back bj penn don't have takedown game like that bro he's not a takedown artist like that get off me he's tired he's, he's bored of chasing me He's bored. There we go. He can't hit me. He can't hit me. Your boy can't hit me. Gone for another leg kick. Body kick this time. Body kick. He's just not good. Let's see. I'm expecting another leg kick. There you go. It was a body kick, but is what it is. There you go. Stop him power. Stops him right in his track. That's what I look for. Look, leg kicks. Why? I don't understand. I want to see this dude's striking percentage when this round is over. He can't hit me, but he's being hit. Gone for the takedown. Stuffed. Alright, you wanted it here. Let's see what you got here, boy. Let's see what you got here, boy. Now, we obviously know, yep, saw that coming. Couldn't do anything about it. Jiu-Jitsu. Jiu-Jitsu. BJ Penn really is the prodigy. You got the rubber guard right there, which just sucks the stamina out of you. But yeah, BJ Penn, he's the prodigy for real, man. This dude won the, the Jiu-Jitsu World Championships only three years after, after starting Jiu-Jitsu, I believe. He got his black belt after three years and won the World Championship. Which is, is not hard. It's not easy, sorry. Throw a few elbows. Alright, this guy's got no ground game. So he really has no chance in this game. 
Kill you on Lim. I like it. Every time I step in and hit a straight, it feels powerful. Feels powerful. He's got length. Obviously, if you get put on your back, might be a problem. He's, he's off the back. I feel like his stats are so low because he probably isn't a good submission artist. Because off his off the back and um, ground defense stats aren't terrible. They're like mid 80s, which I can work with. So that's not bad. His clinch is quite bad. But again, that might just be that he has bad takedowns and bad takedown defense. His takedown defense has been alright so far, but that's just because this guy doesn't know how to set up a takedown. And he's, um, he, he's BJ Penn. So his takedowns aren't amazing. I, I want to see what BJ Penn's takedown defense is like in this game, though. Again, back to it. Let me know if you have any hidden gems. I like using these fighters who you wouldn't know to use before. Hey, he's still touching gloves. Look at my stamina, man. It's, be it's beautiful. It's a beautiful thing. Is he going to continue with the leg kick? Oh, my God. Everything's a kick, bro. Everything's a kick. What kind of... All right, he has the regular. Let's take it to the ground. You know what? No, I don't, I don't want to be on the ground. I don't want to. Let's keep it standing. We dominate him. There we go. Look at that power right there. Look at the power in Dun Hyunkin's hands. Look at what that one uppercut. All right, this guy's being a bit silly now. I want to see this guy's fucking percentages. What's he landing? <laughs> oh, if that elbow landed, he would have been in trouble. Oh, he's got me right there. He's going to try and jump on top, and that's fine. I'll take that. Now let's see what he's like off his back. Block that. Block that. Flip him over. Into mount as well. Oh my god, I didn't know he had that transition. Jeez. Beautiful. Hung Young Kim. I said Kim. Hung Young Lim. What, you ain't gonna... Bruh. Can we not... Yo, I ain't letting you quit, bro. Nah, man. Can you just... Bruh, just escape the shit. I ain't letting you quit. There we go. Fuck, man. Fuck out of here with that shit. Don't be a little bitch. Don't ruin the experience. I'm gonna ruin my experience with the game. I, I've just kind of watched him go into that position. My bad. No, we ain't gonna let you do that, bro. I can't believe dude was just gonna quit. Get out. Get out, man. I ain't going for another submission, that's for sure. You've got to be... Oh, man, we let him flip it, too. Oh, no, we didn't. I thought I missed that. We what? But yet, yeah, that one I didn't... That's that's nonsense. Uh, yeah, he don't want to be on the ground with me. He definitely doesn't. I might have to get another fight. I should have just finished it and got another fight with Dun Hyun Kim, bro. Because this, this opponent is absolutely garbage. Might be the worst guy I've ever fought on this game. He might just be. Like, why is he continuing to just throw kicks, leg kicks, body kicks? I don't understand. Am I missing something? Am I complete? I feel like I'm missing something about the kicks. Boom. Rocked him. Rocked him. Let's, let's, let's get him out of here now. Oh, no, we can't. There we go. Let's let him get up. I want a clean knockout with this one. I should have finished him right there, though. I don't know. We'll see. I might get another fight with him, Young Glim. He's definitely feeling like a hidden gem. He's definitely feeling like, on the feet, I feel like he can go with anyone in this division. Even Robbie Lawler. He feels good. And that might just be because I got a whole lot of stamina. And I'm countering well. He definitely seems like he'll be a counter fighter. Because he got that length. His long strike feels good. His, his, his straight definitely feels good. Boom. On the nose. I'm going to knock this guy out in this round. I'm going to do that. I should have just tapped him out, man. I ain't let, I don't, I'm, not, I'm not letting you quit, bro. Don't be a bitch. There, there, there's two types of quitters. There's, there's the guys who will straight up just press start, quit, leave the match. And then there's dudes like this who will just ruin the match for you. They'll just ruin it. I don't want that easy-ass victory. Get out of here. They'll just ruin the match for you. He didn't even try and get out of it. 
Look at him with his guard. You know what? Just okay. Oh damn, he took me off my feet. So maybe that's what he's trying to do. Maybe he's just trying to trip me. Couldn't reach him with that one. Keep spiking. Keep look at my stamina again. Stamina. I'm just gonna trade. There we go. Fuck you and your leg kicks, bruh. Is he gonna continue? Nah, I blocked that, bruh. Oh, he, cha he changed it up. Oh, he changed it up! Yeah. Hunyong Clem, he I like him, bruh. I like him. Oh, man, the combo game. Combo game is lit. Dropped him. Get up. Get up, buddy. Get up. Get up. There we go. You're up. I like the length. Hun Yong Kim. I keep calling him Kim. Get out of here, bro. <laughs> Boom. Oh! Dropped him, and that is it. <laughs> he got torn to shreddies, man. He got battered and bruised, bro. Hun Yong Kim. Bro, I have to get another one. I have to get another one. That was fun and all, but I have to. I got to do it. That guy got hit with all types of strikes. Jabs, uppercuts, overhands, elbows. Pieced up. Beautiful. Beautiful. If you want to strike with Hun Yong Lim, you're going to have a hard time. You are going to have a hard time. Usually the long fighters in this game aren't fast. Magni, Struve, John Jones. This guy... Excuse me, this guy isn't slow by any means. Not at all. But what I want to see is them fight stats. 24% on the fight, 22, 17. And he got saved by that third round because he actually landed some strides. But look at that, 85% I landed. Jesus. Let's go and get another one. Another match, and this time we got ourselves a grappler as an opponent. So let's go at let's see. Let's see if he GSPs me. Of course he's... Okay. He, he's gonna... Well, if he's a good opponent, he's gonna try and make it seem like he wants to box. And then just grapple me. Look at the power. Oh my god. Huh? Look at that. Step the fuck back, bro. Now he's grappling. Yep. He sees it. You don't want to strike. With thing there we go. He's going night night already. This guy, it's, it's going to be over for him. Yep. Yep, yep. I like this guy, bro. I like this guy. This guy is an animal. He's clinched me. He's clinched me. He's going for that whip. I have no idea why. We're out. I didn't want to go for an uppercut right there. I'll firm that. I'll eat all of that. Now you're hurt. Now you're hurt. What do you want? What do you want from this, bro? He's going for the takedown. I ain't allowing that. I ain't allowing that. Come on, bro. Start going with the uppercuts, maybe. Rocked again. Rocked. We're getting him out of here this time. Getting him out of here this time. Parry. Rocked him again. This guy's getting beaten. To Jesus. This is this is like a 10-7 round. Rocked again. Jesus Christ. Jesus. Oh my goodness. This guy's gonna drop. He's gonna drop. Look at his guard. Dropped. Fight over. Hun Yong Lim is a beast. Animal. Jesus Christ. How many times we rocked this dude in that one round? Like five, six times we rocked him. The guy is an absolute animal. 
Dude! His striking is immense, bruh. Fucking hell. I know a lot of the time my opponent had low stamina. But I have never in this... In the whole game... I'm, I don't think that I've used anyone that feels as powerful as he does in this division. Well, not just in this division, but... Damn, and I've, I've, I've used Anthony Johnson. He feels like a beast. Bigfoot Silver feels like a beast. But damn, the way he's throwing them strikes. And he's got length as well. And speed. I feel like if you're going to stand with this dude, you're going to get knocked the fuck out. Especially if you come up against an opponent who knows what they're doing. It's going to be a mess. Damn, bro. Dude got lit the fuck up. I think I might have a new favorite in the World Away Division. I think I might. I like using Ben Henderson in the World Away Division. I like using, um, um, what's his name? Hector Lombard. Since I've done the randomize, I like using Hector Lombard. But this guy is on another level, man. This guy, if you're going to stand with him, you're going to get knocked out, bro. You're going to get knocked out. He's, it, what's amazing is he's so fast as well with the power and the length. It's, boy, man, I'm amazed. <laughs> I'm amazed. Let's check out his stats. 57% landed. I mean, it didn't even matter in the end. Dude just kept getting rocked. It's crazy. But well, I hope you enjoyed that one. Go out and use Hyun Yong Lin. I think that's how it's pronounced. I've seen him fight a few times. I don't think it's Gyu. I don't think it's pronounced Gyu. Hyun Yong Lin. Go out and use this dude, man. He's an animal. Peace.